this video, we're going to be looking at 10 cursed fake Lego sets. I don't know what to do about them, but they're just hilarious. Let's go. So one of the more popular fake Legos is called Lepin. And they literally take the entire set and copy it. And then they just change the name of the theme, which is super weird. So everyone loves the Lego movie too, I think. Right? Yeah. I hope everyone likes that. But did you know they have it? It's literally called the Lepin Bricks 2. The Lepin Bricks 2. Lepin is the company, so instead of Lego, it's Lepin. The Lepin Bricks 2. I am so annoyed with this. Like... Why? Why did you need to do this? The Lepin Bricks 2. Here's both of them together. Like, look at them. Why do you have to make a one-to-one -one copy? Just make a different toy that might get popular. And then everyone knows Lego Star Wars. One of the most popular movie franchises in the world. Lego created many Star Wars sets, and they still are to this day. But Lepin comes back again with a banger. Lepin Star Wars. W-N-R-S. What is Star Wars? Wunner, Wunner, Wunners. I can't even say it. Who even knows how to pronounce that? Like, why? So the people at Lepin are probably like, oh, we need to come up with a fake Star Wars theme. What do you want to come up with? How about we come up with Lepin Star Wars? And why would they accept that? Why? So Lepin always had Lepin Star Wars. They had Lepin Star Wars, but then I guess they like changed it. I don't know when. Then they changed it to Lepin Star Plan. Like, not Star Wars, Star Plan. We turned them from wars to plan. They are planning something in the stars. Yes. We're not, they're not bad. The entire movie, is, there's no lightsaber. They're not fighting. All they're doing is planning out every two hours of every movie. This is just cursed. Star Plan looks, that doesn't even look right. The Wunners is probably worse, but like. <laughs> and now Lepin is back at it again with Lego Ninjago. Everyone loves Lego Ninjago, especially you guys. You seem to really love Ninjago on our channel. And Lepin is here to copy Lego's Ninjago set. And now they're changing them to Lepin Ninjag. Yes, Lepin Ninjag. Everyone loves Lepin Ninjag. And it's not like Lego Ninjago Masters of Spin Jitsu. No, it's Lego Ninjag Thunder Swordsman. What is that supposed to mean? Are they just talking about Jay? I guess Jay could be a Thunder Swordsman, but what is this? This is wrong. Ninjag. Ninjag. Why do you why isn't it just Lepin Ninja? Why is it Ninjag? Why why is there the G? You don't need the G. And then Thunder Swordsman makes no sense. It's so bad. And we got more Lego Ninjago sets. But this time, it's the Lego Ninjago movie. So instead of calling it Lepin Ninjaga Thunder Swordsman, they have turned the Ninjago movie into Lepin, the new Ninja Saga blocks. Ninja Saga? What are you doing, Lepin? At least Lego's already, like, sued them, but, like... Why this is so cursed looking? The age for the set is ages six and up. I don't think that's right. Weapon, what are you thinking? This is wrong. Get rid of it. Now we actually have something that's not Lepin, finally. I know, that, like, most of it is just Lepin. But it is. It's by Playmobil, which is obviously a copy of LEGO. Like, bruh. And technically, LEGO made a set of this. And then Playmobil comes around and makes their own version of it. But it is the James Bond car. And this looks terrible. It's 54 pieces. It has weird James Bond minifigures. And it says the ages are for ages 5 to 99. So you're not allowed to use this at age 100. You're too old when you're under. You can't play with Playmobil because Playmobil is for people 99 and under to 5. No 100 year old people. You can't play with this. I'm sorry. That's what Playmobil says. That's the rules. Is it me or does Playmobil's character like figures look so cursed and ugly looking? So the next company is Mega Constructors, you probably have heard of. They have the rights to Halo and Pokemon. I wish LEGO had the rights to Pokemon. They should totally get that. And they also have Hot Wheels. But these figures are so weird and cursed. And these builds look so awful and, like, weird. Like, come on. Mega Constructors. Skull, Skeletor Skull, okay? 
I guess some of the Pokemon ones are kind of cool, but like they probably would have been better if they were just Lego. Lego, please get the license to Pokemon. Thank you. I really want that. That'd be super cool. This next set is super weird, but YouTube is telling me that not many of you guys are actually subscribed. So you should go down below and click that red subscribe button really quickly. And then you can click the bell so you know whenever we post. So you can always know when we have some awesome content like this and we're doing fun stuff. Yeah, just click the subscribe button, ring the bell. And if you like this video, click the like button. Good job, y'all. The next set is the Avengers Helicarrier. We're going back to Lepin. Yep, everyone's favorite, Lepin. And they came out with the exact copy of the Helicarrier. If you remember that set from, I don't know when. And instead of Lego Marvel superheroes, we have Lepin Super Escort. Super Escort. What are you thinking? They're thinking, oh, superheroes? They No, they're called the Super Escorters. They escort villains to prison. Let's go. This is so cool. Stop it with the dumb name. So many weird cursed names. It's just wrong. This is really weird. We're going to Lego Minecraft, but no, this is, there's a couple different weird Lego Minecraft sets, but this one is super weird. It's by, I don't even know what this is, JLB. It's just a Minecraft set, but look at this. This just looks so wrong and so, this looks so simplistic. It literally is like a base plate with a couple pieces on it, and the coloring is so bad. It's, ew. Like, the Elder Guardian looks wrong. Steve is just standing on a base plate down there. Oh my goodness, why? What else is there? These are really bad quality pictures. There's also these other weird Lego Minecraft sets. They're called My World. I don't even know what these are by. They just, they're so wrong. I guess there's all these like little, almost like poly bags, but they're like minifigures and other types of fake Minecraft figures. And the entire thing is just called My World. And it's terrible ew there's a tiny version of the mountain cave and it's by my world my minecraft world this is absolutely terrible why just come up with your own set stop copying you're literally stealing from other themes like did you get the license to minecraft no you have the license to my world and you're literally taking their figure they must be sued now it is time for the last theme. The worst, most cursed fake Lego sets of all time, I would say. I've heard they are terrible and like they easily break and they're just built horribly wrong. It is from another YouTuber actually, Ryan's World Pocket Watch fake sets. There's a couple of them like this one, Combo Panda's Fire Truck. The figure is awful. You have Ryan just standing there. I've seen other videos. They are built horribly wrong. They can barely, the pieces can barely be placed. Look on the side. It says, what? So cool! No, it's not. The worst part about these sets, I would say, is that in yellow wording, it says compatible with other brands. What? So they're making these fake sets that are terribly designed, and then they're saying you can put them with other Lego sets. They're, they can be placed onto other Legos. They're technically copying and saying, oh, these work with Lego. This is disgusting. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to sleep tonight with me knowing that these are these sets still exist and people are buying them. I'm gonna have nightmares tonight. Make sure you subscribe. Goodbye.